Yeah, that is true. The Conk <laughs> Republic. We're about to explain why. We have seventh generation conch shell blower, Clinton Curry. Hi, Clinton. How are you? I'm doing well. Thank you very much for having me here. This is a rather unusual talent you have. Well, you know, it's well, unusual outside of Key West and the Keys. Yeah, I mean, unexpected for most people. So how did it begin? Well, this began, it's a, you know, it's a, a cultural piece down, down in Key West. Uh, it, you, you grow up, first of all, learning to, to eat, the, eat, eat the animal out of the shell. And then, of course, you got a shell. You want to make a horn out of it. And so you say, hey, why not? So now we go ahead and just do this. Well, that's one way to get people's attention. Wow. <laughs> it sounds like the horn of a cruise ship. Explain, though, this has been around for centuries. I mean, there's a, how did this all begin? Well, um, yes, the, 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 the conch, you know, I'm from Key West, so I'm known as a conch. You live on the island, you're born on the island, you're a conch. You live there for seven years, you're a freshwater So instead of a conch. Key Westerner, what, you know, Westerner, you're a conch. A conch, okay, absolutely. Take, cool. take, great, take great pride yeah. in that. And, uh, you know, for, De for generations, uh, we've taken pride in, in being conks and, and separating ourselves. And in fact, your great, 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 great grandfather in 1841 started doing this. Well, he moved to Key, you know, he moved to Key West from the Bahamas. But of course, they they brought their love of conks and eating conks from the Bahamas back you know, in, into Key West. So I'm sure he probably played a conch horn as well. But uh, you know, they were actually used as signaling devices. I mean, as you said, yeah. it sounds like a cruise ship. So on a foggy a great day, different dinner bell. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> Dinner bell, you know, grand, grandma's, you know, dinner's ready. Instead of ringing a bell, you give the horn. That's so loud. <laughs> really while loud. you're there, you should also have a conch fritter because that's, oh, that's a classic yeah. uh, keys conch, dish. Conch fritters, conch chowder, conch salad, cracked conch, I mean, you name it. It's, uh, is, it is it common to hear the sound of a conch shell being blown throughout the keys then? It's fairly common. Uh, as a matter of fact, every single night at sunset, um, people <gasps> gather. To play conch horns um, at the world I mean, famous sunset like, like, celebration in Key West. Or, bugle, or bugles, maybe? I mean, like that sound of everybody's making different tunes? Everybody, every horn sounds a little different, and uh, you know, everyone's going to make it sound a little different as well. Wow. Okay, it's well, kind of like one of the cool things, though, in the key, in the keys. Let's talk about some of the other things. Mm -hmm. um, you know, the natural beauty. I mean, it is just absolutely gorgeous there with all the water activities. And you know, it's it's the one thing that you constantly come back to. It's uh, the, you know the fabulous Florida Keys and Key West. We just present you with all different types of beauty, whether it's diving in the water, uh, kayaking, pa uh, paddle boarding, uh, fishing, just trail like, yes, walking. Yes, even. yes, yes, yes. Please to all those. <laughs> you know, I mean, any place you you want to walk. You can kind of get lost in, a, in a, a, a natural forest of the Florida Keys, and you're right. There's singing birds everywhere. Uh, there's, there's just so much wildlife all around you. It's well, especially in Key West, of course, Ernest Hemingway, mm -hmm. a big famous uh, in, in the Keys, yeah. you know, and just museums and so many attractions there. You know, mu museums and attractions, you name one. We have the Harriest Truman Little White House. It's the only presidential museum in the state of Florida. Presidents from all over the, the I mean, presidents from, uh, from, seven gener from seven different presidents have come down to Key West, uh, just to share in that insight, the excitement. So how many place. times have you gone and stood by the southern, southernmost point <laughs> sign? I will say I go by <laughs> uh, a couple times a year, especially when we have some family in town. They love to go see the southernmost point, and so you take your picture, and some days you get lucky, and there's no line. Other days, you know, during season, you might have to wait a little bit of time, but uh, it's there, you know, it it's absolutely. a spectacular sight. Beautiful. Uh, the scenic highway also, I mean, for people who haven't been down it's to the gorgeous. Keys, describe. Well, you know, the, the highway, you know, there's, first of all, there's 42 bridges that connect the Florida Keys to the mainland of Florida. So it's 126 miles worth. Um, You're basically on like a continuous bridge all the well, way down to the longest, the, the, the longest bridge is seven miles long. Um, oh. The shortest one is 31 feet. You know, it's called Harris Gap. And so we have Harris Gap all the way to the seven mile bridge. And, you know, it's a... Uh, uh, the bridges, as you're going along, you kind of almost get a sense like you're floating on water on some of these even, just because you look to your left, there's the Gulf of Mexico. You look to your right, there's the Atlantic Ocean. And I mean, it's, it's just spectacular. See, it's kind of cool because you can take a flight from Houston in the morning and either fly into Miami and then fly on to Key West or drive. drive from Miami over. Oh, sure. You'll be there for sure, lunch. Sure. Oh, but yeah. So do you teach like friends and family when they come in to visit how to um, play the conch? Yes, and um, actually that's one of the things I, I love about this is the, the chance to be able to share a bit of my culture through the conch shell and teaching people how to play. And I'd love to teach you how to, how to play the horn as well. I can't <laughs> believe you're going to do this. Oh, oh man, that was excellent. We're going to have a celebration. Watch out. Okay, what's the trick? Okay. I've never done this, so okay. I have no clue. Well, um, 
If you've, I always ask people if they've played a brass instrument before. Nope. No. Okay. So, <laughs> so this will. You, first of all, you take a deep breath from your from your diaphragm. So okay. you want to really okay. have a good breath. We only have a minute and left. Then you're going to so purse you your lips along, okay. and, and and blow. Just like this. Hold it like this. Yep. Here we go. <laughs> all right. So here we go. It's, that's that's common. Purse your lips a little tighter. Don't blow your lips out. Pull from your from your diaphragm. Oh, oh this boy. Is painful to watch. <laughs> Can I quickly try? Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't think. Well, while he's getting well, know, set up, huh? we do want to talk about the Perry Hotel. Mm -hmm. well, oh, all right. Really? Excellent. I mean, I don't get applause, guys. No one is applauding for me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes. Another day here at the mall. Yes. Welcome to the Galleria. Well, and you know, the Perry Hotel is one of our newest uh, hotels that's going to be opening up in May. Uh, you know, so brand plus spanking new. Brand, brand new. Uh, cool. uh, 100 rooms, 220 slips with deep water access at the marina there. It's going to be, it's a spectacular location. Yeah. So. Wow. But so you, you can just like go and sit on a boat and enjoy it. Oh, that sounds fantastic. A lot of restaurants, you can pull your boat right up to them and, and get out and eat. We brought you a bunch of stuff to blow on, but I'm not sure if we have any time for that. Do you play the bottle too? Oh, I've actually never, 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 never. Pretty good, Clinton. Okay, Let's you got to try, gotta try this one. And what is this one called? I don't know. All right. <laughs> Oh, wow. Okay, he's a little too good at this. Okay, guys. We again, prefer the comps, though. If you want the details of this amazing Florida Keys Island getaway, you can just visit our Facebook page. If you don't know, just go to facebook.com slash Houston Life TV. Remember, it gives uh, gift cards for airfare and hotel. Uh, or airfare and uh, and car rental rental, car, as well as a four night stay in the Keys. It's going to be yeah, great. It's going to be and fantastic. You have VIP passes to the Key West attractions. You can go on our Facebook page, also put it up on Twitter and our Instagram. So we got it all covered on the social media basis. Come on, do it one more time. Okay, one more time before we go to Look break. Yep. And on that note, we'll see ya. <laughs>